Yeah, welcome to this video playing the Blitz game here against the Nevu King from the US, I guess. Yeah, this is the first Blitz game after a long break due to my holiday. I've been away for three weeks and um, I haven't played any chess during my holiday, which was not planned. I wanted to play a tournament in Austria. In fact, playing the same event that I played in 2013 and actually won but um, it wasn't uh, it wasn't meant to be the problem was that um, the the hotel that um, I intended to take there was so terrible that it wasn't possible it was simply wasn't possible to use that and on short notice uh, I didn't get any decent replacement and um, well so I decided to to just uh, skip this tournament and just have a, a good uh, a good time in the holidays without any chess which wasn't so bad at all just for a while not not doing any serious work on the game or playing okay so we have a queen pawn opening here Trompovsky could play bishop d6 here to simplify matters. Now maybe the e5 bishop is slightly annoying. Let's do that. Yeah, he does. He does not really have um, a good control over e5. I can always challenge this piece. Uh, I'm curious what I'm able to do in this game. I really haven't played any blitz chess for more than three weeks. I also didn't do a warm-up game. Just wanted to get things going here. Okay, he can take or he can retreat to f3, but yeah, both does not look very promising. f4, yeah, just I just take play queen g5 and win the e5 pawn. So he basically needed to do what he played. But here I don't have any problems. I can put the bishop on c6 and then think about playing e5. I have an extra pawn in the center here. And the typical problem of many queen pawn openings with the pawn on e6, the bishop on c8, is nothing serious here. Yeah, bishop, he, he, it seems he wants to play e4. Yeah, it's not much I can do about it. Nothing to, to fear, but um, okay, maybe some more preparation. Yeah, with queen c2, he might win a tempo here on, on the king's side. Yeah, maybe play a prophylactic move against that. It's uh, useful anyway for the back rank. Okay, yeah, this was to be expected. However, I can take now and maybe play play rook d8. Is there any point in playing rook d8 first? I, I guess I should take. And then rook d8. Gaining a tempo on the queen. Yeah, I'm slightly ahead in the fight uh, for the d-file. Hmm. Yeah, I guess I'm going to take. If he takes with the queen, I have rook d2. And here we are rook d7. Hmm. Yeah, it's difficult to um, to play for uh, for something substantial in this position. Hmm. Queen g5, intending rook d2. Or rook d5. Yeah, well, rook d1, rook d8. Okay, I can try that. Maybe play that. So I have queen d7 if necessary. Yeah, 
yeah, move like rook e2, d4 here now would lead to an isolated queen pawn position that white probably does not want to have. Maybe he should just take. Or rook back to d1 is also, also possible. The rook is not really doing much on the fourth rank anyway. Okay, he decides to allow the, allow the isolated queen pawn. He now must take with the rook. Yep. So let's see, is there something I can do here? This, generally speaking, is not much. Maybe here, combining queen d4 with queen e1. And it's an active move anyway. Yeah, this is, uh, this is possible. Hmm. Yeah, if I take the king and pawn endgame is certainly a uh, should be somewhat better for me. I mean, but um, I don't think it it should uh, should be a win. Yeah, but what what do I do with the queen zone? Probably not much anyway. Yeah, yeah probably b5. <laughs> Fixing the the pawns. Yeah, I know. Run the king over. Yeah, he's very quick here. The king coming to uh, 2d3. He will still have the isolated queen pawn after king d6 and c4. Now he should play c4. I guess no, he didn't. Time warning. Hmm. And yeah, this I'm not not terribly sure about. I always have this threat to come to um, to come to C four. Okay. Uh, but then I lack a tempo. I this I played terribly. I should have played h4. I really should have played h4. Hmm. Why didn't I do that? Should have played h5 h4 this was really bad hmm. yeah this is uh wow check not sure what he's doing here check Yeah, this was a suicidal mission at the end. Maybe he wanted to win on time or anything. I don't know. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm terrible, really. I should have played h5. Uh, sorry, this was also wrong. <laughs> I should have played h5, h4 here. If I if I go h4, I'm, I might still have some chances. a3, a6. Ah, okay, he has got a4 here. I thought he's uh, now forced to move the king after which I'm winning. 
but he's got this a4 move this uh, this saves the day i cannot take hmm, maybe i can check for a draw i mean check yeah, I can block here. Now this is a draw. But he must play a4. This means that it, uh, it's not winning in any case. Maybe h5 is also, also wrong. I, I, I overlooked a4. This was the problem. Maybe I can do something else here, like h6. Computer wants to play h6 here. Not one hundred percent sure what what to make of the end game. I'm 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 very sure that uh, white white should play here and just make a draw. This is probably a draw. But uh, okay, played this stuff. Computer wants to go h six. That's very very tricky. H four maybe. What now? Keeping the tempo game alive. Maybe this is uh, this is something different now compared to um, to the to the other situation where the king side was blocked. As after a4, am I take and c4, king e6? Now I still have this e5 idea. So what I'm talking about. <coughs> something like or maybe g5 yeah now this is straight lost so he must take check take yeah this is again a clear win a3, c6, a2. And uh, uh, this gives black very good winning chances. But okay, it's <laughs> very deep. So the king and pawn end game here, um, he should really play c4, which I think should, should be much better in comparison. I need to prevent this, so king c6. And now I don't know some normal moves. Here I don't think I can can do much. Uh, can do much. I've got this symbolic advantage with the isolated pawn, but he's got the more active king, so this should probably can cancel each other out to a draw. Okay, thanks for watching.